Uh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of my name. So we're back to more Binding Isaac Rebirth. As of this moment, this video has been recorded um, November 5th. Still no patch for the problems. A lot of people are having issues, but uh, my issue doesn't seem to be on the known um, known list of problems thing. And hopefully the patch will just somehow fix it. So yes, we're going to be plus up guys. Welcome to the stream. Let's play. Let's continue. Um, will you be playing um, so? We you play sorry mode? Story, not sorry? Well, anyway, story is the same thing. As long as you keep winning, you know, the game, that's basically the story. So, um, let's do a regular run today, and then we'll go ahead and move to a, um, a, what's it called? Move over to a, one of those challenge runs. So, let's get started. Let's see. So, we, let's try our hardest to unlock Samson. Unlocked by beating two levels without taking damage. We'll try our hardest to do that one. So let's go ahead and play as Eve. We just unlocked Magdalene and Eve on the last episode. Let's go ahead and try it out. Now, Eve is weak as shit. I do not believe any changes has been made to Eve except for those that glorious hair. Oh my god. Alright, so we have the dead bird, which uh, whenever we get hit, it spawns a dead bird for the room, which runs around and hits enemies. Uh, contact damage. Oh, ah, Magneto. It's perfect, actually. It's really good, especially for this room that I just found. The money! I'm rich, bitch. Okay. Cool, nice. Five more cents, we'll be able to do whatnot. Um, there is a curse room, but like I said, we are going to try to absolutely not get a hit to unlock Samson. Uh, that means no curse rooms, no uh, hitting myself until we go Babylon, or Babylon, all that, etc. So, Eve, um, oh gosh. Starts off a little bit quicker than all the other characters, and but also has really really low damage, indicated by smaller her smaller tiers. Yeah, it's whatever. So we, we have a lot of money. This is great. Gonna lurk and watch Netflix. Hey man, good for you, buddy. Watch that. Uh, what do you watch? The hentai, whatever you watch. Whatever. Go for it. All right, got a heart, which you should not pick up whatsoever. All right, so all we gotta do is go through two floors without getting hit. Twelve cents. That's not bad for a first haul. Gurglings, um, I don't, I don't have too much experience with fighting these guys. Um, considering my low damage and the experience that I have fighting these guys, chances are I'm going to be staying in this room for quite a while, and I'm probably going to get hit. So let's use this time to, of course, learn these guys' abilities, traits, uh, their attack patterns, pretty much just the AI in general. So it looks like only when they charge is when they drop the creep. And I haven't seen a, uh, oh gosh, I haven't seen any champion version of the variations. The Gurglings, what an interesting boss. And I say these guys kind of fit in the game. And I'm just wondering what other kind of uh, variations could it be? Like uh, maybe uh, Super Gurglings or something where they always drop the creep, etc. So, so far, haven't got hit yet. Not a problem. First run of the night, however. And uh, yeah, I do have a timer up right next to the game. As soon as it hits around... Um, Oh god, as soon as it hits around 30 minutes, I will restart not just um, the round. Oh man, what's this? What is this? This is a uh, Synthol. Damage and range up. Synthol. Dude, our tiers are much, much larger than before. Alright, one floor good, one more to go. So like I said, as soon as it hits around 25, 30 minutes, I'm going to restart the whole game. But saving. Because I think it's just linked to how long I have the game in. It seems to happen as soon as I just play for an extensive period. Perhaps uh, 20 to half an hour is when it usually occurs for me. And hopefully this will be the last uh, couple of episodes where I will have to do this. Because it is such a bother having to do that. No keys. I would love to open that chest. Alright, let's find the boss as soon as we can. Oh my gosh. Remember, we have damage up now, so we should be aight. Let's see, two hits per. That thing is scary, this thing is scary. I think uh, he has quite a bit of health as well. This might be a small champion version. Okay, this room. Alright, not too bad, not too bad. These guys are sometimes hard to dodge, but with a large room like this, I don't think it's too much of a problem. <laughs> the freaking sound effects. It's amazing. Alright, can't wait to see the rest of the items. So I also went, um, I looked at the actual, oh, how far can I be? It looks like it's always, look, it's always going after me. So this thing has a large, large range. Alright, cool. The whole room. So yeah, like I said, I looked at the achievements. There are about 170 
eight, uh, it's just off the top of my head, I could be wrong, but achievements, and I've only got seven or eight of them. We're going for all of them, definitely. Um, mm, let's go ahead and find the secret before. What's up, Sonic Guy? Josh Rebirth, welcome to the stream, buddy. Hope you will enjoy your tastes of the rebirth. Alright, still no damage, which is good. Also good is, uh, we're not gonna get a, well, we're gonna get a deal with the devil. And I was browsing the forums looking for problems on the game, and I actually stumbled across some sort of, uh, some item explanations. So I might as well tell you what it is. Uh, the goat head, which we picked up, I think, one of our first episodes, of course. I, you know, it changed my appearance like crazy, and I couldn't figure out for the life of me what the hell it did. Apparently, well, it's all speculation. It's from the forums. People say that it makes it so either you have a, you know, an always chance to uh, spawn a deal with the devil, or basically just a higher chance in general. Uh, but yeah, there it is. Also, I also learned about the nerfs and buffs to two different characters that were in Vanilla Isaac. Let's see, people people are already, yeah, of course, Master, the game has been out only a day, it's not that hard. For me, I haven't been playing that much, so it's honestly not surprising, don't worry, yeah. Oh, what is this item? Hello, you are Pisces. Tears up, knockback shot. Ooh, more knockback. Alright, we're gonna go in here, see what we can get. Ooh, don't want that, I will take the soul heart, soul heart however. Alright, let's get this, and not the pill, we'll leave it. All right. So what was I saying? Yes, the buffs and nerfs to two characters. First of all, Kane damage is still the same. Items are still the same, but it's the item that he had, which is a little bit nerfed. Luckfoot. It does not change pills anymore. It just makes it better odds of winning. On uh, oh gosh, it makes it better odds at winning arcade machine and that kind of stuff. And the difference with the other character, Samson. Um, Bloody Lust now affects the whole floor rather than one whole room. And I remember talking about this a long time ago in one of the Vanilla Isaac episodes. Except my variation was a little different, and I think mine is still actually better. Um, apparently, Bloody Lust, uh, from the forums, activates whenever you kill an entity, increases your damage. And it happens for the whole floor, not just that room. What I was saying when I talked about it a couple months ago was that the way to be balanced and still fair is it, you know, it halves the damage after each room, but you still keep it for the floor. Alright, here we got. Picked up a pill. You are two of diamonds, doubles our money. We can go buy the steam cell, which I think we will. And this is a new trinket Bible Tract. Faith up. I don't know what faith does. Alright, we'll see. Alright, so I'm going to use the two of diamonds here. We'll be able to buy the steam cell in the shop. I'll be going to go ahead and do that. Make it so uh, all uh, subsequent shops will now be pretty much half priced. Uh, round it up, of course. So activate you. Uh, yep, this. And then bam. Bam! And then I'll put one set in here because I am a good, good player. Okay. I'm glad that the money saves up. I don't know how high it can go, however. And if you are new to the stream and just watching or haven't seen me play... Isaac before, please, for the life of me, do not spoil any items and all that stuff. I'm still trying to just learn everything on my own. I wanted to go to the dead room, but I thought, you know what, let's just not do it this run. I just left. So, that's two floors without taking damage. We should be we should be able to get Samson now, right? Yeah, Samson unlocks. Steam achievement on the bottom right. You guys can't see it. I don't know why you can't see it, but okay. I got chocolate milk. Oh yeah. Okay. Now I can go willy nilly activating items. Explosive diarrhea, run! Oh gosh, that was close. I'll be cool if the secret room was to the left. Um, that's health up plus speed up. Uh, shot speed up, I'll take it. Stem cells, it's just HP up now. What? Why did they take away the shot speed up from this item? I don't understand. But anyway, our damage should be, hmm, let's see, we got two damage up items. But I don't think they were that strong, so I'm guessing our damage is, is pretty much a little bit higher than base Isaac, which is 3.5. Maybe 3.7-ish now, because, you know, once again, still going off base Isaac um, information. Eve probably starts off with uh, 0.75 times multiplier for each damage, including um, starting damage. Oh, I just got a new item in my Steam inventory. Looks like I got another Isaac card. You guys should trade with me. Let's collect them all! 
Alright, so, so far I haven't taken a single damage yet. I didn't go to the devil room, which, it, you know, honestly, I, I could have just checked. But I didn't want it to accidentally be a Krampus, and I'll probably take damage. I haven't fought Krampus yet. Put some salt in it. Alright, so literally no damage yet. Okay, well, there you go. Go, blue bird. Oh, blue bird, baby. Dead bird. Do your thing. Alright, I think AI might be the same. Damage is still probably the same. Alright, so no red heart yet. Also, it's still a good chance, a very good chance of uh, getting the deal with the devil. Alright, so keeping an eye. Oh, uh, I don't want to go in there. I'll take red heart damage unless I get a soul heart in there, but what are the chances, right? Alright, these guys charge randomly. You gotta be careful. Oh, gosh, be careful. I don't know if it's random or if they get a certain, like, distance to you. It could be a little bit of both. Like, maybe it's random as when they get closer. But these bats are a nice welcome addition, you know, to the enemies of the game. The game in general just looks nice. Uh, oh, perfect. Okay, we can open up every single long oh, money equals power. I gave away my money, but uh, we'll try our hardest to um, bank up on a lot more. So, oh my god, an eternity heart. Okay, we're not going to pick that up until we get to the next floor. Because uh, I'm definitely going to try to go to the curse room after the boss. And I don't want to lose this thing. So let's take up when it goes power. Get the hell out of here. So every little set we pick up sh should increase our damage by uh, 0 0.04. Yeah, 0 0.04. Unless they change it, once again, I would wait until I have at least 20 to 50 runs underneath my belts. And then we'll go to the wiki and learn all the items that I feel like at the time. Money equals power! Oh, I got hit. Oh my god, they changed it so uh, the money equals power is now glasses instead of um, just turning your eyes into dollar signs. Which I think it was, yeah, it was cool putting it into dollar signs, but that's cool. So this is a uh, pretty lucky find on this thing. Thank you for the keys. Ooh, these guys. Okay. Oh gosh, oh god, oh god, oh gosh. I'm not too, uh, too pro at dodging these guys yet, even though they're actual... Abilities are pretty simple. I just gotta get used to it. I got, I got hit. So very little chance with the Jill the Devil, but we'll see what happens. You know, we only, we only have three HP. Oh, that's damage up right there. 0.01 or 0.04 right there. Um, not gonna go to the shop. You know, if I really, really wanted to win a run, I'd go to the uh, arcade or sorry, the donation thing in the, sh in the item room and blow it up the smithereens, collecting all the money in there. <laughs> Uh, is that camera good? Because I'm slouching in my chair now, so I want me to be center. Oh my god, bats everywhere. So yeah, our damage is nice. Just uh, no way to actually become a horror Bamalon just yet. I can't believe I didn't get a hit there, but uh, I'm not complaining. Just gonna chalk it up to uh, awesome freaking hitboxes. Oh, I thought I was gonna dodge again. Now, more, more hits to Red Hearts doesn't really matter too much. Thank god for this freaking magnet. It's pretty awesome. More money! More money, more problems. Got 99 problems, but a uh, magnet ain't one. Oh! Actually, I'll pick it up now. Reason being, let's let's go get the other one. Um, okay, Sonic Guy, good night, buddy. Have a uh, have good uh, sleep. Hopefully, you can uh, finish watching the episode on YouTube later. And I'll see you in future streams, buddy. Sorry you couldn't stay awake for this. Alright, so let's go grab the other attorney heart. Grabbing it will uh, pretty much make it so... Where is it? Oh, it's in the item room. That's right. So grabbing it will give me a heart already. There you go. And uh, because we already took red heart damage, let's go ahead to the curse room, huh? Alright, troll. Troll, roll, 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 bombs, and guppy's paw. Which I am going to take, but not use just yet. Reason being, uh, maybe we'll actually get a deal and we can trade something, but at least we can hold on to it. Oh, Master, you are leaving too? Well, good night. Good night, you guys. Everyone's leaving. Alright. Oh, this room again. I have to get better at dodging these guys. It's like, I have to look at like, one side, and then the other guys just pop up. Plus the variations of these guys, where they throw out the brimstone, instead of the tears, just make it oh so more dangerous. So, you know, I think Guppy's Paw might do the same thing, but remember, we can only have up to 12 hearts at once, and 12 of any types of hearts. I'm not gonna just say your name, bro. Ah! Tell me what to do! Good night, bro. Alright, see ya. Alex is still here, thank you, bro. I am starting to say bro a lot more, I thought I died. 
Oh my god. We have to use one here. I'm sorry. Just in case. Just in case. We are Horde Babylon now, which is good. Let's try our hardest not to uh, grab any uh, hearts. Uh, that's going to be kind of tough. Nope. Nope. I want to stay Horde Babylon. Jesus. So our speed is up. Speed is up. Damage up. All that good stuff. Let's fight this boss, yo. The peeps. All right. Not bad. Jesus, Louise. Okay, no, no, no. It's good. It's good. One hit. At least we can get the dead bird on him. Increase our deep, our dips. We have increased knockback, remember, because we picked up um, Pisces. I think uh, there's an item for maybe all of the um, all of the astronomical signs. I could be wrong, but it seems like we've seen a couple of them already. Oh my god. Ow. Yolo. Yolo. Yes, that was a reference. Got that when we learned uh, learned that when we played uh, Isaac Vanilla. Oh, the screw is a very good item. Gonna stay away from these hearts. Uh, increases our damage and uh, shot speed up. Oh, sorry, tears and shot speed up. So far, so good. Really awesome. Okay. So once again, we're holding on to we're like you know we're not gonna use the thing yet. The thing being Guppy's paw. Oh, what the fudge me? Okay, these guys are kind of scary. Huh. Wow. You know, I'm glad, like, at least the, you know, the first time we're playing Eve, we actually had some damage. A lot of damage, actually. Some really good tier rate. Money, money, money. Equals more damage. <laughs> awesome. The only way to get there is to use two bombs to make two bridges. Interesting. Alright. Try our hardest not to pick up any hearts. Um, but we do have Magnus, so we gotta be careful. Okay, let's see what's going on here. These guys. The bone throwers. It's the bonies. Oh. These things really look like Zelda items. I wish you could push them. Maybe you can. It's just like, it's a super secret. Like, you could push one somewhere. Oh, more money! Flow to me, powers. Flow to me. Let's see what's in our shop. That is a new item. It's half off. We're going to buy it, even though it is going to lower our damage a little bit. This is a broken watch. I think it's broken. What does it do? Absolutely no clue. Please do not tell me in the chat. I'll maybe figure it out on my own. So it wasn't a space bar item. We still have the guppy's paw. Don't know what it is. Maybe. Okay, it's a broken watch. So maybe there's a chance. Oh, it says, don't be full health. Look down. Uh, maybe it's bad. Whoa. Those guys are slowed. Okay. Okay, looks like it's slow to some enemies down. Now here's the deal, is it gonna slow... Is it a chance to slow enemies? When you enter a room? Because it looks like he's still slowed. Maybe there's a chance for them to be slowed the whole room. The whole floor. If it is, that's a really cool effect. Mega fatty! Alright, I don't know what his abilities are. Let's get ready to dodge at an instant. Oh shit! Mega fatty! Oh, I'm scared. Fatty, fatty, fatty. Oh god damn! Whoa! Whoa, 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 Oh my god! You are such a fatty! He's sucking, he, like, when he opens his mouth, he, like, sucks me in a little bit. Oh, he's doing it again! I think, uh, you should, you should be able to throw a bomb in there, right? Let's try it. If he ends up sucking again, I'll put a bomb in his mouth. Ow. Come on, suck it. Oh, he died. Wow. Alright, no deal with the devil. But we did get health up. Let's continue going to the rest of this floor. I do, uh, we haven't been to the item room yet, and we will do that. Damn, Mega Fatty. First time fighting him. Glad uh, it didn't go horribly wrong. We uh, were able to win. I'm taking two hits. Chance for the Seeker Room. Huh. Well, we'll keep looking. We got three bombs. Some poops. That giant spider thing scares me. There's like different variations of it. Like this red one shoots tears. I think the black one we saw earlier this run makes it so he spawns enemies. Our damage. Oh, we lost. Oh, we got the damage. Oh, we got the health up. Which made it so we lost our horror Babylon state. This is uh, the poop trinket. We'll take that. The poop trinket, if you don't remember, it makes it so uh, yeah, every once in a while you just drop a poop. And that's it can shoot it for consumables. All that good stuff. I still do not know what this little Bible track does. And look, they're slowed. 
So yeah, it looks like there's a chance whenever you enter a room. It's a, it's not a bad um, item in the shop. I just forgot the name of what it was. Every enemy, even the ones that get spawned. That's pretty cool. Thank you, Soul Heart. <laughs> Let's see what else we got. Some easy peasy guy right here. We'll uh, check for the secret room. Nope. All right, looks like there's gonna be one. Maybe left of this room up here. Let's check it out. It's probably here. There's a good chance. I think it's here. All right, and we have two keys, and that's it. This guy just hanging here in the corner. He's hanging around. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get this pill. Pills, uh, from my experience, have always been mostly bad for me. Lemon party. Oh, this is another room that got slowed down. Ooh. You can tell because the music. Explosive diarrhea. We can definitely save it for a future boss. Let's go ahead and go to our item room. And we end up getting aha, tough love. Which uh, is actually pretty bad in our situation. Because we, we got the luck down. Um, and yeah, luck down makes it so it procs a little less. But anyway, it's still a good upgrade. Makes it so every once in a while, depending on our luck, we have a chance to shoot a little tooth shot. Definitely very visual, you can see it there. I think, if I remember, it does 3.5 damage or something, or 2.5 damage of our or whatever we had. So let's get the heck out of here. What, YOLO mode soul heart? Nah, not at the moment, man. You gotta think about it. I'm going to try to get to deal with the devil. I do not want to get rid of all my hearts right now. That would just be silly. Absolutely no reason to have it. Dips one. Oh gosh. Oh! Oh, got a slow room. Ooh. Why are you slow, bro? Let's see. Oh! Damn! Ooh, I thought it was the one that shoots um, just three little shots, but I should have looked at his mouth. So if we end up losing both of our spirit hearts, I will activate Guppy's paw. I don't want to get rid of all my hearts, but I also don't want to not get a deal with the devil. So what are we doing that? Alright, it's 22 minutes in the video, so uh, I think about three more minutes, and I'll go ahead and restart the game. I don't want it to crash, and I think, like I said, it's based on a timer. That is a new item. It looks like the sad onion, but let's see what it is. Dead onion. Toxic aura tears. Whoa. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. That's pretty freaking cool. Um, toxic aura. It looks like it's a... Uh, what an, hey, look at that! It's it's, uh, it's spectral kind of. I wonder if it poisons. Don't pick it up. Oh, too late, Gavin. I already did. It was too late, bro. What's this? Whoa! Mo 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 oh! What are what are mom's hands doing in here? What the fuck? All right, dead. Yeah, this is pretty cool, uh, spectral tierish type of thing. Oh. It's really weird. Um, no, I don't want to go in there. Hey, it might be greed. Okay, I'll do it for greed. Damn it. Oh, it's all good. Man, we have money equals power, but I'm not gonna blow up my, uh, my money reserves for one run. Let's keep going. Wait, what? What happened? Oh, did you think it was a different item? So, yeah, we have the slow... And a cool item. This is awesome. Brag. Our Eve runs nice. I just wish we were a horror Babylon again. Let's fight the boss. We have explosive diarrhea monster too. All right. Hey, take this, buddy. Woo! Ah, fucker. All right, let's do this. When I picked that up, it dropped my range to zero and it changed my damage to zero. Why didn't it do that? Um, I'm gonna use this. I don't know, bro. Maybe because I already have a lot of damage up and range up already. I picked up a couple of range ups. I think one or two. I don't know. Maybe it's a different item. Or uh, maybe your game is bugged. I, don't, I, don't, I have no idea what you're talking about. I wouldn't know. I'm sorry. Alright. Let's do this. Monstro 2. You are... Ah! You are now a force to be reckoned with. I like how even though this thing is spectral-ish, um, it does do knockback still, which is pretty freaking awesome. Pretty sweet, as a matter of fact. Right, boss almost dead. Dead bird, can you like do your job, please, and you know do what dead birds do? Well, if you did what dead birds do, he wouldn't be doing much. Deal with the devil. Come on. There we got, and we got a uh, magic mush. All stats up, including health up. Let's see, Guppy's paw, uh, Guppy's tail, which we will pick up. That is a new familiar. I don't want to try. You know what? It's only one health. 
New familiar to try it out. Rotten baby, infested friend. What is he doing? I don't know what he does. I don't know what he's doing. Let's continue. Uh, oh wait, let's restart the game just in case. I freaking hate having to do this. But until the game gets patched, we will just have to be doing that. So, sorry, it's only going to take like a second. And let's go ahead and redo this here. Better than having to redo the freaking um, floor, right? Would you like to know what it does? No, uh, no, thank you. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll figure it out probably. It's all good, unless I specifically ask for it. No, no, just please no. Thank you. All right. Let's do this. I'll probably figure it out. I mean, look at that. There, he's doing something. He's doing something. That's the beauty of Isaac, man. Learning everything on your own. Oh, you nutsacks! All right. Let's gotta keep. Gotta keep a close eye on the little guy right there. He did something. When it, like when I killed an enemy, he opened his mouth. You want keys? I'll give you keys. I got enough. As long as you give me something nice, I won't regret it later. Dude, do you want to die? Give me a key. Hey, I'll take that. Tack fly. It's fine by me. I just hate how it's the same freaking color as the freaking kamikaze flies. It kind of sucks. Don't want that. Ah, Jesus Christ, you're scary. Blast for spectral tears. So we'll go ahead. This is the first time. Let's see what this is. Ball of steel. Nice. This is my first time trying out this tactic of actually restarting the whole game rather than quitting and starting uh, to see if the bug will uh, appear. Oh, yeah. Bob's brain. Oh, I thought that was a common cold. Bob's brain hurts me a lot, but I'll definitely use it again. It's pretty nice. You know what? The bug hasn't even happened tonight. Maybe it still won't happen. But I'm going to do this thing, you know, save and quit until at least the next patch, which should be tomorrow as of this video is going up, or at least fairly soon, less than a week. Uh, did I go to the item room? I did. All right, I'll do it. Hey, Tammy's head. Reusable tear burst. I'll stick with Guppy's paw, thank you. And we need one more Guppy on him to get Guppy. All right, I'm glad Bob's brain doesn't blow up until it touches an enemy. It's useful. Still don't know what my little uh, minion does. Oh gosh, Wrath. All right, go. Boom, Whoa, we got fucked up, okay. Very nice. Uh, no tins of rocks, making sure. Our damage is sweet. Our tier rate's nice as well. And it looks like that's the floor. We already found the secret room. Let's get the hell out of here. Drink some of my chocolate milks. Oh god. Oh yeah. I think I put too much powder. Oh, I'm so sweet. They're so sweet. Alright, so no crashes yet. Because we restarted. <laughs> Alright, let's go. The dips. Definitely gonna go arcade. Blood machine. Perfect. Horde Babylon ready to Oh no. Good Ivy bag. Or Babylon ready to go. What a horrible night to have a curse. Alright, perfect. Um money equals power. This is what though, this is depths two. Depths two, we're not gonna get a deal with the devil. I'll just blow these guys up anyway, just so I can get money. Look at all the money I'm getting. End up getting in their hearts. Once again, play with the money. So here's the deal. I'm gonna I'm gonna take Guppy's paw with me, right? Oh my god, my damage is insane. With the Horror Babylon plus all that stuff. Um, this build right now is really good. Really good. Oh my good lordy. I think I might keep the Ivy Bag just in case I pick up a heart. Guppy's Paw is nice and all. But just in case I pick up a heart. What the hell are these guys? Oh my god, the are New enemies, new enemies. Oh my god. Haven't seen them before. That was kind of scary. Alright, looks like you don't get the invincibility frames when becoming Horror Babylon. Mommy, your videos are very fun and entertaining. Thank you for the great content. No, dude, thank you for watching. It's uh, fans like you, or should I say, moblins, that keep me and you know keep me uh, motivated and you know making videos every single day. So thank you. Pulse warm. Our uh, tiers are now gonna wub 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 it. I don't know what it does. Maybe it makes a larger, higher tier shots. I don't, I do not know. But I just know exactly what it does visually. Uh, what it does for us, uh, you know. Otherwise, I have no clue. Uh, push pin, piercing shots. We already have piercing. We don't have a key. Oh, 
What is in here? Oh, this is a boss trap. Our damage is amazing though, so I don't feel bad opening this up. Look at that. Just freaking destroy that guy. Monster 2. Easy. I still don't know what, what, what my familiar does. I'm sad. I'll figure it out. Dude, our damage is insane. Oh my god, I'm definitely keeping the pulse warm through the rest of this run. Uh, well, I mean, that thing's cool and all, but I don't know what Faith does. Alright. So I need a key for this. Okay, I'm gonna blow these fires up and poops. I mean, we do have a magnet, so if any money drops, it'll just go straight to us. So yeah, maybe I'll take the IV bag. Guppy's Paul is cool, but... I mean, we have the chance of getting more money. To the devil room. Some black hearts, and uh, I don't want that. Let's say, uh, Krabby Familiar. Do not want it. Oh, it takes us straight back over here. That sucks. Okay, so we have a black heart, which every time a full black heart is consumed, or sorry, I say, getting gotten rid of by damage and it hits every single enemy in the room for a certain amount of damage I don't remember freaking gravity isn't moving my tears back and forth look at that you can use it to gravitate like uh, that one movie gravity all right let's activate this to get our money oh it might be worth it just to do this it would be very very nice to um, you know put all of the money into the shop to continue upgrading and whatnot but let's do it for the run do it for the run because we have money equals power I think I'll just hold on to it Pulse, 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 pulse. So remember, we have Bob Thoughts. Do not, do not get too close and get killed by your own explosions. Oh my, Jesus Christ. Cool, cool. Not bad, not bad. Look for Tinted Rocks. Woo! The thing activated. I don't know if it's worth it getting this item for 15 cents. For 7 cents? Yeah, it was nice to pick it up for the first time. I forgot what it was. It was the Broken Watch, right? Okay, that's the boss. Remember, we can't get out of there. It's a scripted mom fight, which should be absolutely no problem. Um, you know, if you uh, check out how much freaking damage I have. This is a very good Eve run. We were able to, uh... Oh, well, there he is. Freaking got hit by Bob's head, which I told myself I wasn't gonna happen. But it happened. Alright. Alright, so no keys, which means no item room or shop. And there's no other way to do so. I already blew the whole arcade up, so we're screwed. And, okay, we're going to take, you know what, we only need one heart. So what we're going to do is we are going to Gubby's Paw once, just to get three more soul hearts, but then we'll take the IV bag. We need at least one red heart container so we can continue using the IV bag. So there we go. What's up, Martiak? How's it going, bro? Broski? Wub, 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 wub. Dude, the wubs. I think it's just damage up, right? Be wrong. Okay, let's go. And mom fight. I should have saved it. I silly should have saved it. Just in case. Oh, freaking Bob head. Come on. Oh, I got lucky. This is a slow to room here. Nice. Don't crash, please. Don't you crash. Alright, so there you go. Okay, pick that up. Activate this. Pick it up. Activate this. Health up. Oh. And activate. And activates. You know I'm playing Isaac and recording. Why would I jump in and play Dota? Please don't. All right, next floor it is. We are. We have 56 cents. Our tears are massive, and we haven't crashed since we restarted the game. Let's keep it that way, huh? So we're gonna use this method of restarting pretty much in the middle of the run, and if it works out, we'll go ahead and be doing that until they patch the game up. I almost touched the creep on the ground. Gotta be careful of that. Oh Jesus Christ! Ha! Ah, I'll snap. Oh, my one key. Well, might as well do it. All right. Nice little slow room. Actually, yeah, I think it's a pretty worthwhile item, especially if it works on the bosses. Uh, it's very nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, our damage is fucking insane, dude. It's Eve run. Woo. Money equals power. It's just amazing. Which enemies are here? Oh, what the hell? All right. Well, that seemed to be no problem, I suppose. Monkey's Paw. Wish granted. Don't know what it is. Let's go to our challenge room. Um, th oh, I can't, man. I can't not pass it up. Chance to be coming. Uh oh, we got three swords. That's perfect. But chance to, you know, get the last guppy item? Hell yeah. Besides, you know, 
You unlock the catacombs. You unlock the catacombs. All right. Well, uh, looks like we can spawn in the catacombs now. That is gonna be insane. A whole slew of new enemies and whatnot. We have yet to fight any horsemen that we unlocked. Remember we did that. Psh, dang, that's cool in the challenge room. They can have like like a cursed treasure chest. That was really helpful. All three actually had soul hearts for me to use. I think our our tier like really really fucking large now. Man, they're amazing. All right, trying to get hit. We're gonna go to that cursed room. We have so much hearts. You got here. Uh, pills. What's this? Guppy's head. Guppy's hairballs appear in the basement. You got your tongue. And we are now... We should be Guppy. Yeah, we're, we're Guppy, alright. We're gonna keep this. We keep it. We became Guppy. I found pills and luck down, which we won't take. Oh my god, what am I doing? I'm gonna blow this up. Idiot. Oh, damage reduction. Infamy. Nice. Alright. So we are the Gupster. Which means every time we hit an enemy, we can fly, and every time we hit an enemy, drop some kamikaze flies. Jesus Christ, this character looks insane. Eve! Eve, girl, what's going on? Oh, that's not a Tinsel Rock, is it? No. Dumb, dumb. I thought it was a freaking thing. Yep, there goes some kamikaze flies. Oh, man. This is the strongest we've ever been so far. And the irony, it's the strongest we've ever been on a character which I pretty much have nothing but hate for. Just because, I don't know, I just had so many bad runs with her, but, yeah, it's all about the luck of the run, you know, and, but just, more than not, you know, at least if you don't get any potential damage items with other characters, they don't have a damage down, innate damage down like this character does. Oh my god, are we gonna go straight to the boss? Yeah, we'll do it. We shall do so. Oh, okay. No, actually, our damage is hella good. Let's keep going. Our kamikaze flies travel with us through floors instead of going down to five what no way dude we can charge up and just kill the okay the boss is gonna die from all these flies like no matter what this is insane mama gertie all right mama gertie's about to die like so get fucked um unbelievably dude you can well i think that's stupid cheap speed and shots we don't that's stupid cheap being able to do that Okay, let's go. Yeah, beast mode. You, you know it, dude. It's amazing. All right, last four of the game. Let's do it. Utero 2. We'll do it with Guppy. And you can... Like, uh, the Kamikaze flies. Oh, God damn it. The Kamikaze flies stay with you. As long as you don't, like, throw any out. I mean, have any hit. Uh, save that for the boss. So try your hardest to uh, stay back. Ooh. I, I have enough money. Let's just see what he has. What do you got for him, bruh? Wanna die? Health up. Thank you. Alright. We still be Eve. So just don't get close enough for the kamikaze flies to activate. Save him, like, bum rush the boss. It'll all be good. I'm gonna open this up. Oh man, this is awesome. Wub, 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 wub. And if we are able to hit with, let's say, a um, one of those freaking tooth tears. Uh, yeah, two tiers. Holy crap. A two tier, the kamikaze is just. Oh my god, my, my freaking. My damage! 90, almost 99. Look at our freaking. Oh my god, this is awesome. Um, this is the most OP I've ever been so far in Rebirth. Guppy's crazy. Kamikaze flies, please no. Yeah, we can still die. We don't have that much health. Gotta be careful. Thank you for the soul heart. Especially needed. Gully. G -g -g I know what you meant. Don't worry about it. Woo! Look how many flies we have. Tears up. Oh my god. Where's the boss? Dude, the boss is gonna get des destroyed right now. No, gubbies, don't do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, those eyes are scary. I got the Rubber cement. Achievements. This leads to Shoal. Should we do it? We never fought Shoal yet. We haven't fought Shoal yet, and we are in a really good position. Let's do it. Hell yeah. The Shoal. Rubber cement has appeared in the basement. Whatever that means. Probably a new item. 
All right, Kamikaze Fly still stay with us. Whoa, scary, but hey, our damage insane. Absolutely no problem. So we have 99 cents. Our damage is maxed with one equals power. And just in case we pick up a heart. Oh my god. Oh, screw you guys. Oh, dude, our damage is fucking awesome. Yeah, we haven't been to show you. That's why we're here. This is awesome. Yeah, if this run is, should be super easy. Pick up. Might as well pick this up. Alright, try to speed run this mofo. Woo! Good job, Eve. Oh, what am I doing? There we go. I need to keep it at half heart. Oh, whoa, 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 What the fuck? Okay, you can't kill those, it looks like. Oh, dude, what the hell? Okay. Alright. Wow. Oh, man, interesting. Gotta be careful, we can still die. Still die. Just kill them before they kill me. This music is freaking scary. Hey, you got balls right in the head. Oh, there's the boss. Oh, gosh, darn it. Okay, be careful. Oh my god, we're almost dead. I actually need to pick up all the hearts now. Uh, I'm not gonna use IV bag anymore. Alright, show Satan. Let's do this, bro. Go Kamikaze Flies, do your thing. Do your thing. Whoa, dude, is that Krampus? He looks insane now. Well, he keeps getting, well, he's still getting fucked. Oh. Alright, look at that. Boss is nothing. Boss is absolutely nothing. Get out of here. Get out of here, Satine. Judas, okay, we unlocked Judas and we got the Razor. Awesome. Very easy run. Well, we got lucky. No, no, no. I earned it. I mean, we got everything we got because we didn't get hit on the first two floors. Oh my god. Isaac, where are you going? <gasps> Goodbye, little baby. There he goes. There he goes. Hell yeah! I dropped Guppy's Paw, actually. We got the Razor. And we got Judas. So we unlocked two characters this run. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. It helps so much. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I upload a lot of daily videos. More Isaac on the way. There are two videos of Isaac every single day uh, for this month. And then as soon as it hits December, we'll jump to one video per month so I can push it back for other series, of course. Should I really do for two for a whole month? Because that's a lot. We'll see. So, wait, wait. What are you guys' opinion? Uh, two for at least a whole month? So there you go, and I'll see you guys next time.